Lorenzo Ghiberti's artwork of Sacrifice of Isaac was sculptured in bronze and created in 1401. It is currently located on the south side of the baptistry in Florence, Italy. This artwork represents Abraham about to sacrifice his son Isaac according to God's commands. Sculptured out of metal, this artwork has rounded edges and pointed sides. You can see at the right of the panel, Abraham about to sacrifice his son. On the top right edge, an angel hovers over Abraham and Isaac to stop Abraham from sacrificing Isaac. On the bottom left portion of this panel, there are two servants. History of early Renaissance art in Italy begins in 1401 with a prestigious competition for a design for the east doors of the Florence Baptistry. Lorenzo Ghiberti's and Filippo Brunelleschi's pieces were a part of this competition. In this competition, seven artists were chosen, but only Ghiberti's and Brunelleschi's pieces survive to this day. In the late 1390s, a military campaign led by Visconti of Milan sought to take control of the Italian peninsula. Writings led by humanists urged Florentines to adopt the Republican ideal of civil and political liberty associated with the ancient Romans and identify with the spirit of liberty. To be Florentine was to be Roman, and freedom defined both. In 1402, Visconti died and ended the threat of invasion. The theme of the sacrifice of Isaac for a higher cause paralleled with the message of the On the right is Brunelleschi's piece, and on the left is Ghiberti's. As you can see, Brunelleschi's representation of this biblical scene is much more powerful and aggressive than Ghiberti's representation, which is more graceful. Now on to the baptistry. The construction of the baptistry was started in the 1200s, but the original architect died before he could complete it. At the time, the baptistry had no dome, so the dome was later built by Filippo Brunelleschi in the 1400s. The baptistry was a place where people went to worship and get baptized. It was intended to be the biggest church in Christian history. The dome of the baptistry is crowned by a mosaic ceiling. This mosaic cycle depicts the three sections above the high altar. The last judgment, the rewards of the saved, and the punishments of the damned. This last part is particularly famous Evil duels are burnt by fire, roasted on spits, crushed with stones, bit by snakes, gnawed and chewed by hideous beasts. The other scenes on the ceiling depict different stories in horizontal tiers of the mosaic. Choirs of domination, powers, archangels, angels, principalities, virtues, the thrones, Stories of the book of Genesis, stories of Joseph, stories of Mary and the Christ, and finally in the lower tier, stories of St. John the Baptist. The gates of paradise or the east doors of the baptistry depicted Old Testament scenes, including the story of Adam and Eve. Cain and Abel, Noah, Abraham, Isaac with Esau and Jacob, Joseph, Moses, Joshua, David, and Solomon and the Queen of Sheba. Overall, these doors had 10 panels, all sculpted in bronze. This is one of the panels from the doors. The story of Jacob and Esau. 
Jacob and Esau were brothers born at the same time but of two nations. Esau grew up to be a hunter and Jacob was a plain man. Esau had come back from the field and was faint asking for Jacob to feed him. In exchange for him feeding Esau, Jacob wanted his birthright. Esau gave up his birthright to Jacob. In this panel, Gilberto uses simultaneous representation. He includes more than one scene in this panel. This panel shows the story of Adam and Eve. Gilberto uses simultaneous representation in this panel as well. This panel shows God giving Adam life and creating Eve. In the back above Adam, you can see Adam and Eve with a serpent representing the fall of man. Gilberti had other works outside of working on the baptistry. This one is called the presentation in the temple. This one is called the ascension. And this one is simply named St. John the Baptist. Gilberti also worked on the north doors of the baptistry. He created 28 panels. Some of them were called Baptism of Christ, Temptation of Christ, Jesus Walking on Water and Saving Peter, Last Supper, Christ Captured, Ascent to Calvary, Crucifixion, Resurrection, Pentecost, and more. Lorenzo Ghiberti uses texture to give emphasis to this artwork. Abraham, Isaac, and the angel on the right side of the artwork stick out more than the servants do on the left side. This draws your attention to the right side of the panel rather than the left. Now for my artwork. My artwork is a depiction of Moses parting the Red Sea. I chose to represent this scene from the Bible because Moses, just like Abraham, was a faithful servant unto God. Abraham had faith to go up and sacrifice his son and believe that everything would be fine. Moses had faith that when he held his staff in the air, the sea would part and allow Israel to flee from Egypt to freedom in the wilderness. It is titled, Have Faith. 